Rockshox recently launched the brand new Lyric, um, but there's another fork in the line that's pretty special, and that's the new Yari. It's got 35mm stanchions just like the Lyric. It's got the oversized, the extra material in the lowers for stiffness, just like the Lyric. It's got a deep crown, like the Lyric, for stiffness. But while the Lyric is a, a high-end product that's going to retail for around 850 pounds, and the cool thing about this fork is that it's going to be 250 pounds cheaper than the Lyric. One of the key ways that they did that was that they switched to a motion control damper. So this fork doesn't get the charger that you see on Pike and Lyric. And it's not just the price that sets the Yari apart from the Lyric, it's the travel too. This fork is available in 120 to 180 for 650B and 120 to 160 for two niners. So one of the big stories for RockShox is the, the new torque cap compatibility. And what that is, that's like the 31 mil end cap on their hubs and it increases the contact between the dropout and the hub and that's the boost stiffness. The cool thing about it is, is that if you don't have a 31 mil end cap compatible hub, you can just put any normal 15 mil hub straight in here. So the solo air spring in the Yari also benefits from the increased volume of the negative springs, just like on the Lyric. Um, and that combined with the, the SKF wiper seals, which have got reduced friction, the two things together are gonna to mean better small bump sensitivity and improved grip. You'll also be able to get this fork in solo air or dual position air, so you can drop the travel down. Um, and one of the cool things is that previously, you weren't able to fit the bottomless tokens to adjust the spring volume. RockShox now have a new bottomless token that you can use for dual position air, and that's gonna make that fork feel so much better. I've been pretty happy with the damping performance out of even the revelations that come on bikes currently, so if they've made it better, then it'll be a really good fork. And I think that's the key thing with this fork, especially 140, 150 mil trail bikes, and I'm thinking it's around the 2,000 pound mark, and I'm thinking this bike would be so much better with a pike. But obviously that would push the price of the bike up, um, so it comes with a revelation. And revelation's okay, but it's got 32 mil stanchions, so you can get out of shape pretty quickly on it if you're riding the bike hard. This is where I see the Yari really making a big difference on those bikes. It's available in a huge travel range, and it's gonna be more cost effective. You're getting a 35 mil chassis, it's gonna be stiffer. Yep, there's gonna be a slight weight increase, but in terms of performance, I think it'd be much better on those bikes.